Okay, what I've got here people is 1993 BNR32 GTR grade 4 BB. The seller's comments BBS alloy LM 17 inch 33 genuine Brembo caliper N1 headlights with HID uh, twin plate clutch trust front and rear damper. What I can see here is the air con's not working. The uh, underbody's got a little bit of paint on it. The seat's faded. The handle's worn. Steering wheel. There's your steering wheel. It's a little bit dark in the building here, so I'll get my torch out and see if it'll focus on there properly. Probably not. Anyway. The seats, they're saying a little bit faded, but um, you know, a little bit worn. Maybe you can get a bit more of a look in it here. Okay, 73,000 Ks. Dash looks okay. Let me go around to the engine. It's quite a clean engine bay. Don't really see any issues. It's got um, some service stickers. 54,000K was a timing belt was done. Looks like 2008 in December. On the 25th. Yeah, somebody's working hard on Christmas Day. You people that don't know, Christmas Day in Japan is just another day. It's no holiday. Rust on the bolts. We've still got our factory radiator, radiator cap, inlet plenum's been painted blue. No real issues at the front of the car. And one headlights. A lot of people just say that these are um, R32 early model headlights. Now, front and rear reproduction plastics. It's cracked down the bottom. BBS 17 inch alloys. Brembo R33 calipers. Now, underneath this has been painted. You can sort of see it there. Doesn't look to be any rust sort of happening. Aftermarket dump pipes. I think I noticed a Pexi branding on them before. Maybe it was the other one I saw earlier today. Anyway, more to it. Overall condition of this car is quite nice. Uh, a few of the things I'm noticing. It's paint condition. It's been painted. It's quite a good paint job. Looks nice. Uh, get at it close. You can definitely tell it's been painted. And the reason I say that, I don't know how I can get on there. But maybe there. You can see the edges of the rubber. Let's see if I can get the focus on it a bit better. The orange peel. You know, factory paint jobs not like that. You can see it there as well. I'd say it'd be fairly easily fixed with a cut and buff. You know, if you that's if you're really fussy. I don't think it really needs cut and buffing, but it's not too bad. There's a few little things around it. Somebody's I'll get on that. Somebody's trying to get this focus happening. That's a bit of glue which is coming down underneath that moulding. 
which still got the factory rubber on it. The top moulding there is quite good condition. Windscreen rubber is good. Tyres are a bit bald. Just get under this side of the car. Give you a bit of a look at that paint. And see, generally these GDRs they rush a little bit. With these sort of areas here. This one looks like it's pretty good. So I wouldn't be disappointed if I take that black paint off and there was nothing there. I just think that the previous owners tried to protect it when they've done the paint job. Just make sure these arches haven't had any work done. Rusted out some of them. Get through this section here. You can get some rust. Right down in there. It's all pretty rust free. You can see all the original stampings. This is a fairly bad video, sorry. I'm just running out of space and it's in the building here. So the lighting's not very good. Anyway, it's not too bad. It's a big start price on this car tomorrow. You got 1.68 million yen on this as a start price, which is a little bit silly. That's a bit of bird poo. Quite nice all the way around this car. It's quite straight. No accidents, no real issues. Let's fire it up. I did notice through this section here. You're probably not going to see it though. Some paint jobs, you know, if you're a painter you'll know that there's some water gets in the air lines when you're painting. This section through here has got some very, very mild pitting. So when they've painted this door, bits of water have come out when, with the paint. Uh, generally, uh, not too bad. These have a tendency to rust right on the edges there. This one's good. And also, I can't really get in there. But this join, I can see it from where I am. You can just see it there now. Through this join here. If I pull my finger away, you can see a little bit of brown stain. It's just bubbling a little bit on the inside of the guard. It's quite common. Something we should always check. Open. The steering wheel's been recovered in Japan by the looks of it. I see them occasionally. They don't do a too bad of a job, but you can definitely tell that it's not a factory's cover. It's a bit thicker in the edges, especially through here. It sort of bulges a little bit, as you can see on this side. Bad video. Runs quite nice. There's no hiccups. 